What is going on everyone and welcome back once again to another YouTube video today in this video Um, I have no plans I Hello? Get, get, do you mind? Get your tentacles out of my base, please I, I don't really have a plan for this video to, uh, to be completely honest Um, Build ourselves a scanner room right here as you can see um, And yeah, I, I I don't have. Oh my God! Get your tentacles out of here, please. I don't have any plans for this video. I, I really don't. We just got ourselves the scanner room up and running. Um, I guess we should probably go out and check out some of these. I think I checked that one out already. But um, yeah. We got ourselves some grow plots going on over there as well. These these jellyfish love just hanging out around here and shoving their tentacles all up and everything um yeah, that's right this is like almost destroyed right now we need to get ourselves a repair tool that might be first Welcome aboard, Captain. first thing to do on the to-do list is to get ourselves a repair tool there it is a silicon rubber crystalline sulfur titanium what do we have in here? Where did the silica... Oh, the crystalline sulfur. I know exactly where that went. <sighs> I dropped it. I got rid of it. Because I didn't think I was going to need it. And I don't know actually where to get crystalline sulfur. Okay, well that's where we are. Some crystalline sulfur down in here, it looks like. Um, I don't know where that is in relation to this. So, like, we're he Warning, emergency power only. Oh boy. I knew this was gonna happen. I knew that this was gonna happen eventually. It's okay. We have some creep vine right growing right here. We just chop some of this up as much as we can. That's as much as we can. And we just top back inside, throw that in the uh, generator. And Warning emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Emergency. Starvation imminent. Seek calorie intake immediately. Power restored. All primary uh, I, I, systems I don't want to starve. Oh, it's nighttime, which means it's nearly impossible to see the fish. Oh, you're a fish. Come on, fish. Give me sustenance. Thank you. Ow! And you. And you. Come on. There we go. And you. And you. Come on. Come on. There we go. Alright, let's go back inside and cook these suckers up. Oh, and yeah, we have quite a bit. Alright, let's hop right in here. I need I need some water as well. Bladderfish are scarce around these parts, you know. Bladderfish are scarce. I could have sworn I picked up more than that, but it's whatever. I Vital signs stabilizing. Consume creep vine, I guess. That that's a form of sustenance. All right, cool. Um, can we grow creep vines over here as well? Oh my god, we can. We totally can. Um, ruin plan? It doesn't look like you can. 
It makes for great storage, but you really can't grow it. So there's that. Um, I'm gonna just I'm just coming over here just so I can get some more creep vines for this grow bed. Because if I can just grow creep vines, that'd be perfect. I have an infinite number of um, have an infinite number of seed clusters and creep vines to throw in to throw in my little bioreactor generator. Right? I know you can actually grab this stuff, can't you? Alien for a sample. Um, that, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Scanner goes to two. You go to three. You go to one. Because that's the order that I usually have have them in. Also have some seeds. Warning: thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. That's that. That's nice. There's some copper that I just dropped on the ground. Let's pick that up. Um. <sighs> the ground trapper requires a battery. I have the perfect battery I can use for that. Sea glide. Let's unload the battery. Deployables. Grav trap. Grav trap's in number five. This should fix our little infestation problem when we're working around our base. Yeah, come closer. I absolutely dare you. Ooh, it's, a, it's catching bladderfish too. Huh. Ow! Okay, they can still bite when they're like this. I'm confused. Oh my god. Cook up some of this. We need some of the. We, we need a bladder fish for the water bottles. Oh my god, come on. There you go. Eat and drink. I wish that would produce some more. What does it cost for a power cell again? Two batteries and silicon rubber. That's actually not bad. Speaking of batteries, I don't understand why I don't do this. I'm absolutely ashamed of myself. Let's get ourselves a battery charger. It requires a wiring kit, copper wire, and titanium. Easy stuff. Easy stuff. There's there's that. There's that. There's that. We, we've got it. We have absolutely got it. So let's get ourselves the copper wire. Let's get ourselves the wiring kit. And then now let's get ourselves you go to four, five, a battery charger. Battery charger. Let's put we'll put one here. We'll also put one on the other side as well when we get enough. Finally. A device that can put to good use those rechargeables lost to the back of the catch all draw. Yes, so you have no battery. However, whoops. 
I have you, which, hang on a second, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. You, you unload, you unload, and you unload. And then battery charger, boom, boom, boom. That one doesn't really need to really go in, but, you know, it is what it is. Wait, I know exactly where we can get ourselves some diamonds to actually make ourselves a modification station, too. Welcome aboard, Captain. Um, because a modification station requires lead, computer chip, titanium, diamond. I know where to get some diamonds so we can actually grab some diamonds. Um... Titanium, which we actually don't have titanium. Do we need lead? You know, I think I, not. Not the coffee machine. Yes, we need one lead, which we actually have. One lead in our inventory right here. We have one lead here too. And the two lithium. Um, give me one minute. Plus two in good. Three lead wiring kit. No, I just named it W. Okay. Um, plus two ingot wiring kit. I think it was three lead. I can't remember. My C truck's over there. But um, I'm going to place this right there. Let's go grab our sea truck. I think that was for the storage, wasn't it? We need a repair tool too. Oof! I didn't even think about the ice. Completely slipped my mind about the ice. Um, right here should be a good spot. Should be able to make it up to the surface, and I should have plenty of space to drop down. Oh, vehicle bay, module, storage module. That's the one that I kind of want the most. You can kind of see it right there. Can't really see it here. Let's bring this down here. That that eye jelly is gonna get in the way, isn't it? Don't you dare. There, perfect. Oh, beautiful! Locker, locker. I have so many lockers now. I forgot how how amazing these storage compartments are. Okay, I guess you can change the color. It, like changes randomly, which is kind of weird. This this is absolutely beautiful. I I love this. And you can enter and exit now from th from there. Disconnect modules, exit. Beautiful. Still don't have the backup camera, which is kind of odd. But um, so that's the fabricate. That's the modification station. Um, in terms of repair tools, crystalline sulfur. Where do I find crystalline sulfur? I have no idea. Just 
throw those in there. Yeah, I have no idea where to find crystalline sulfur. There, they were saying that there's crystalline sulfur in this cave over here. Which I, I guess if this is us, we would go like southish. You know what? That is good enough for me. We'll take all those batteries. All right. Well, we have ourselves. A module right now. One of the best modules for the sea truck. Anyways, so we'll go southish, see if we can find ourselves a cave. If there is in fact a cave, oh, that's a bladder fish. I kind of want that, but no. If there is a cave over here, we'll go in it. If there's not, um, let's just remap everything. So you go to two. You go to you're in five. Everything's where it needs to be except for you. So you go there. Is there a cave over here? Alright, that's why we need the HUD. Looks like there kind of is. Um, let's grab you out. I'll put the 100% in. Hi, Mr. Sea Monkey. You don't by chance have crystal and sulfur in here, do you? That's a laser cutter. Kind of need that. Two of three. Boot postule. And high reactive compounds. I'll grab some. I don't know what they do, but I'll grab some. This artifact could provide useful information. Processing. Ultra capacity tank fragment, yes, please. One of three. Of course, it's one of three. Seek fluid and take. Oh, screw you and your fluid and take. Uh. Doesn't seem to be any crystalline sulfur in here. Nor do I know what I'm looking for. So another laser cutter fragment, which I think is the, actually the last piece for the laser cutter. Yep. New blueprint synthesized. Radiant sequel. For me? Thanks. You're the best, sea monkeys. I take back every mean, terrible thing I've ever said about you. There seems like there's a lot of gold in here. Cannon could care less. Crystalline 
Chris Lawrence over. That's what we came in here for. Thankfully, that's what we're leaving with. Some silver. Why the hell not? Let's get up to the surface at least. <sighs> Alright. Well, that's been a productive trip. We found ourselves a bit of an artifact. Um... Found ourselves our cave. I can visualize so a location where we may find an important component for my body. The image is hazy, but I am sure it is correct. A stark surface landscape, dangerously cold. Curved spires stretch to the sky. How do humans cope with the loss of memories? Like forgetting someone's birthday? I don't know, it just happens. No, important memories. When you die, some quantity of knowledge is lost forever to the next generation. Isn't that... I'm warning you, if you call humanity inefficient one more time, I will swim us both into the mouth of a leviathan. Is that sarcasm? I am still having trouble differentiating. How inefficient? Efficiency aside, does the loss of knowledge not create complications? Well, it can be sad. On a personal level, losing someone can be traumatic. But it's harder to process the idea of generational knowledge. Humans aren't networked, so we can't even be aware of what we're losing moment by moment. But we do have written and oral histories. History is interpreted, and memories are not perfect. This is true, but it's what we have. We try to learn from history, some of us more than others. Memory is complex. Maybe it's not ideal, but it's what we have. Welcome aboard, What Captain. happens when you no longer have the memories of others to combine with your own? You make your own memories and interpretations. You have to experience life as an autonomous being. Discover yourself. That idea is foreign to me. I hope as we continue to discover these artifacts, my connection will get stronger. Seek fluid intake immediately. I like Alan. Alan's pretty cool, you know? Alright, I'm just getting some more of this stuff for our little um, bioreactor up there. That's stuff. You have an empty battery slot, so I need more titanium. I don't think this locker has any titanium. It does not. Alright. Alright, um. I'm 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 stupid. I need silicon rubber to make the repair tool. Like what the hell did I come in here for? I came in here to make a repair tool. Um, do I have any copper? I have one piece of copper. Is there still this piece of copper out here just laying on the floor? Cause that'd be pretty dope. Doesn't look like it. Oh well, we'll go and find ourselves another piece of copper. We have the ribbon plant, we can craft ourselves another battery. Boom. And then we're off to get ourselves a um, modification station. Anyways, silicon rubber. It was with the seed clusters, that's right. Uh, there's no seed clusters nearby. Yeah, that's right. Get stuck in my trap, you stupid fish. 
And that's what you get for biting me. You know what? You guys can stay there for eternity. I was gonna kill you and eat you, but now you can just swim there for all of eternity and I could care less. Alrighty then, repair tool. Nice and handy repair tool can be bound to number five. Have to be out of the truck. I really don't know. Yeah, I think you have to be outside of the truck to actually repair it. Okay, cool. Alright, um, let's label... Mm, I don't want to take up all this inventory space. I have no idea what cave postules do. But, um, anyways... We're off. Um, I just want to see where... I think one of those was already a body cache. I don't see any new ones, because these are all artifacts still, except for that one. I guess it was the laser cutter now if he wanted to. And what do we need? The pasta lingot, lead, beer chip. Eh, that can wait, honestly. Seek fluid and take. That's nice. Um. And we were going to get the diamond for that. That's what we were doing. <sighs> Alright, well I guess we'll head back over here to this base. Um, since we don't have a fabricator inside this, uh, the sea truck. As of yet, we'll just come back over here, get... Uh, get ourselves some bladder fish, get ourselves some water bottles, quench our everlasting thirst, and head down to get ourselves some diamonds. Uh, I want to be closer before I get out and get me the bladder fish. There should be plenty of bladder fish over here. So, um, Maybe I'll make a grav trap over here too, just so that way it's easier for when I need to actually get bladder fish. And copper ore and titanium, that's actually not that bad. That is not bad at all. Um, copper ore and titanium, here I come. Please be copper ore. Nope, you're dead. Please be copper ore. Perfect. That's got to be the most perfect scenario right there. I'll place this grab trap a little bit closer to the base. That way it's not much of a hassle to actually come out this way to uh, grab the fish. Oh, 
Um, let's put you on five. I see a truck. And I love, I absolutely love the sea truck. Sea truck. Mm. I think the sea truck is a little bit better than the sea moth. That's, that, that, that's one thing I'll give the sea truck. The sea truck does have more utility than the sea moth. It's like a sea truck plus the uh, cyclops? Is that what the big submarine was called? I think the big submarine was called a cyclops. Anyways, if it, I, I'm pretty sure that's what it was called. I'll put that right there and that should start catching a bunch of fish. Bladderfish. 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 Seek fluid intake immediately. For me? Oh my god, these sea monkeys are getting better and better and better. With their gifts. Oh my god, look how easy this is. They can't do anything. They can't even swim away from me. That's amazing. I should have done that ages ago. Grab trap. Hmm. So good. So good, the grab trap. And we need to get ourselves another thing, uh, titanium, which isn't going to be that big of an issue because titanium is super easy to get. Right? Let's come into here. Ooh, look at all that. Look at all that sustenance. Mmm, tasty, tasty. H2O. The cost of a couple bladder fish. Um, I don't need food as of yet. Vital signs stabilizing. Mm, I haven't had full thirst in forever. This is amazing. This is absolutely amazing. Alright, um, we're heading down over here. I, I want to get some of those artifacts, but I don't know exactly how to get to them, which is the problem. Alright, this is where I lost my sea truck the last time. <coughs> um, I am going to 100% not do that again this time. Because one, that being embarrassing, lose, uh, and I would be losing my storage module. That's not happening. Stay away from me. Uh, we're reaching diving depth at a hundred and forty-six. Not bad. Um, I do know we need table coral sample. We also need some titanium. Now we should be able to just slip right on down through here. I think we need two table core samples, so we'll grab two. All right, this this is the scary place, right? This is the deep, the deep underground, the deep end. Has has these scary squid sharks that I don't know where you're going. All right, but we're looking for these areas right here. These areas. Uh, inventory full? Y you're joking. You're absolutely joking. My inventory is full. Get back up to the surface. Get back to my sea truck. I, I really need to get the depth module on my sea truck. Kind of what the modification station here is for, but yeah, 
you know. Let's do that. That should be good enough. Alright, we'll use this locker, I suppose. Let's just dump all of our garbage into there. Perfect, that leaves up a lot of room for diamonds. I'm gonna grab as many diamonds as I possibly can. We have the titanium. We have the diamonds. We have them. They're here. We can get them. You're, you're scary. You are scary. Let's fill up the rest of our inventory with diamonds. No. No, I don't like that. I don't like the sounds that you're making. Fabricator module fragment, I don't care. Just give me a Z diamonds. Oh, I think gel sacks are important for something. New blueprint synthesized. Grab some of the thing because we need that. We're just, we're just gonna grab a bunch of resources that we need. Can I? I can't. I do know that gel sacks are used in a crafting recipe for something. Um, I gotta find an oxygen plant. One right there. It's a bit far away for my liking, but I'll take it. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god. Oh my god. This place is just trying to kill me. It's just literally trying to kill me. Let's pick up a couple more of these gel sacks. I do believe we can grow these at home, so we shouldn't need too many of them. Let's grab a couple more diamonds. If we find more lithium, let's pick it up. All right, inventory is full. Let's get out of here. Let's get out Warning. of here. Warning. seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh, we're good. We're good. We are good. We're so good. We don't even know how good we are right now. We are good. So good. We got ourselves some... Ten. We got ten diamonds. Ten. Ten of them bad boys. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen. Alright, we are back. Let's look at our riches. Gel sack, which can be used for food, which I don't get, but, um, you know, it's a thing. What? Are the gel? Arrow gel. That's what. So we don't need gel sacks now, but you know, arrow cell, arrow gel. I mean, is kind of a thing, and that does become important later on. Um. That's. So we got all this stuff for the fab. Um, do we have enough for the computer chip? Let's just check. We need gold and copper. Wire. That that we can do. That we can absolutely do. We can do that. Get out of here! I don't understand why I come back here. I really don't. I hate it here. It's terrible. Terrifying. And it's just an overall bad place to be. Um, I just ran right into something. Alright, so that's that. Let's open up this storage and throw all of our diamonds and stuff in there. We'll even throw in a couple of the gel sacks in this one. Gel sack, and we'll just throw the rest of our stuff in there. And here, we'll just boom, boom, because I don't really care. 
But that frees up a lot of our inventory space to actually grab some food on our way back. I'm curious. Body cash. Yeah, there's... Hmm. I'm pretty sure the Z13 I've already been to. Pretty sure. Wait, isn't the... Sorry, I'm so sorry. We need copper wire, which means we're doing two things of copper. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Um, means the grab trap should be over here. I gotta put a beacon and label it like food source or something like that. Damn, look at all the fish that this thing's getting. Absolute beast. Bladderfish. I don't want to pick up the grab trap. I mean, they can swim, but they can't hide. This thing's beautiful. I love this thing. Should have done this so so long ago but i chose not to i don't really know why i chose not to put the grab trap up but it's up now that didn't sound too good just fish bouncing off the window right there all right We're finally back home after a long, stren strenuous journey. You will be mine. Pangling. Oh, you're an adult pangling. Ugh, boring. All right. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. I left all of my. I came in here, right. I just left everything back on the ship. No, I need that. Thank you. I just left everything in here. Alright, let's grab everything that we took from... Whoops. That's all my other stuff. I can see we yeah, I think that was empty. Yeah. Don't don't shock me, don't shock me, don't shock me. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're the best. Alright, um I should get another um locker up and running. Just like that. It's a little bit off, but you know, it doesn't matter. Alright, I need copper wire. Copper wire. Copper, 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 copper wire. And we can get the copper wire over here. Well, not the copper wire, but the copper to craft the copper wire. We can get over here, over here. If we just follow this wire down, we can get ourselves some copper wire. I know this for a fact. For a 100% fact. It's a good source of copper over here. No, I, look. Look at that. Look at that right there. What is this? Oh, look at that. It's copper ore. Just, just chilling. 
Copper ore just chilling here. Here we come down here, there's even more copper ore just chilling. I did take some of it, I don't know if it respawns. I took some right there, so it doesn't look like it respawns. Inventory is full. Still have no idea what this is, but we're going to be getting ourselves a thermal blade. Which will be absolutely beautiful. We should also probably look into actually getting ourselves a, um, the upgrade for the sea truck. The depth upgrade, which is right here, which is plastic ingot and enameled glass. And because now we have diamonds, we can actually get ourselves enameled glass. And we also got some lithium, which means we can actually get ourselves the plastic ingot, which is beautiful. Oh, man, my neck is killing me right now. Stuff I go through for content. My neck is absolutely killing me right now, but you know what? It, it's it's worth it to be able to play Subnautica. Is it really though? I don't think so. Well, I'm here because I don't plan on leaving anytime soon. Um, so where the hell did that battery go? Did I just lose a battery? Um, what's in here? No gold, that's for sure. Oh, there's the, there's a battery. Let's put that there, that there. And... What the heck was that? Right there, there, there's the missing battery. Don't know where it went, but it's been found. Yeah, I'm not having this named W. This will still be called Locker. Because I don't feel like changing the name right now. Hello? You all see that? How's this looking? This is looking beautiful. I don't know what the heck that sound was. But we need to, we actually should find ourselves, um, I have the silver ore. Um, that, that'll be for the rain, no speed. But we need to get ourselves the computer chip and the magnetite for the um, HUD. Because the HUD makes things so easy to find. So, so very easy to find. Alright. Um, I don't want to go out. We don't need the habitat builder right now. So I can unload this battery and, un and load that battery into this boy, bad boy. And head out. And hopefully those batteries will be charged. Let's head this way because this is where we found. Are you guys enjoying your your um your your, your imprisonment? I guess you could say. Hmm. That's what you get for for biting me. Don't bite the hand that feeds you. You know. Anyways, <coughs> we'll come down through here because I know that there was a lot of. I don't even think they call it sandstone anymore. In the original game, the uh, the outcroppings that look like the ones that give you gold here, I think they're called cal calcite, calcite, something like that. I don't know, but they used to be called sandstone. It looks like sandstone, so I don't know why they don't call it sandstone. I think it's right down here. Yep. <clears throat> I have a full inventory of stuff. So let's just we'll fill up one of these lockers. We shouldn't need more than we shouldn't need more inventory space than that. 
I think we just need one gold. And it's this stuff. Caliverite. Whatever the hell that is. Well, there's the gold. We can get another gold piece. That's uh, titanium. I'll take it, though, because we need a lot of titanium for the base building at, uh, stuff. There's some more gold. I'll grab this as well, which happened to be titanium. You know, I want a bunch of these, uh, spinny fish. If I can no catch them, Jesus Christ. Wait, I haven't actually catched a spinny fish? Damn. Alright, I don't know what I've been doing in this game, but I haven't actually catched myself a spinny fish. Let's catch ourselves a bunch of spinny fish. Why don't we? You know, because I, I, I think spinny fish are the best looking fish. Is that for me? Thank you. Oh, is that for me too? No? I'm taking it anyways. Um, come on. That's one, two, three, four. It's only four. I want a lot more than four. I want at least six. But I can't seem to find any more of the spinny fish. It's, it's like they're all gone. I have no idea what happened to the spinning fish. It's like literally no more. It's like literally no more spinning fish. What the hell? Spinny fish just abandoned me. I want to take a couple sea monkey eggs as well. I am stuck. I am now unstuck. Alright, let's head back to base. I got more spinny fish when the time comes. Are there penguins up there? I didn't want to jump that because I was afraid I was going to jump right on top of the iceberg. I guess the easiest way to check to see if there are banglings is to just swim out and check. No penguins. I'm sad now. Base. Let's head back to the base. I get sidetracked so easily. I'm the master at distractions. Master of getting sidetracked, master of everything. Did that move? It had to have. 
at 100% movement. It, this thing 100% moved. Just put it like right there in the corner. Welcome aboard, Captain. Do you have glass? You do. Um, these are almost full, so I'll take them. I'll put you back at five. Let's reload you up with a new thing, and we'll get ourselves. I guess we can't put it there. Put it right there. Right there. And that's where the spinny fish come in. So I think an aquarium full of spinny fish will look absolutely mega. So I wanted to throw in some spinny fish. I can't. Can't do anything with that. Alright, anyways, the reason why we came here. Computer chip. Um, copper wires back out in the truck. Back out in the car. You know. Did I put it in here? Here? Is it here? It's right here. Um, let's just throw in a bunch of gel sacks because we don't need them right now. And we'll grab the rest of this stuff because that's kind of important. So I don't need the sea monkey stuff. We do need the table coral, so we'll keep that. It would be nice if the jellyfish didn't just hang out around my little entrance there. Alright boys, we're getting ourselves a modification station once I f find where you build the mod oh no the modification <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm dumb sometimes modification stations built here all right uh, where do we want this thing you know what? it'll go right here and it's gonna like it it's gonna like it right here Thermal blade? Why not? Alright. Now, with a thermal blade. Jesus Christ, that's like a death trap! What is going on here? A rave? A jelly rave? An eye jelly rave at my house? You all were not invited. Now, beat it. I need to make a new entrance. I need to make a secondary entrance. I, I can't be coming out of my home and getting shocked by sea jellies, by eye jellies, all the damn time. That's just not going to happen. I need to make myself a new and improved entrance. Maybe a top entrance. Maybe a top entrance will work. Now, there's this ice thing down here. I totally want to check it out. Alright. Um, don't think that this thing can come. This actually might be our second structure that we actually um, check out. I want to see if this... Uh, damn it. Come on! Is this really... But I know there's something back there. I can't scan it. But that doesn't work because, you know, reasons. How, how do I get back there? This wire goes back there. I'm completely perplexed on how I get back there. Um... Hmm. Oh, 
Alrighty then. I think our next big tool. That's not where the tools are. Our next big tool should be the laser cutter. <laughs> laser cutter requires crystalline sulfur. Anyways, I think we've run out of time on this episode, unfortunately. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up on the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel because that definitely helps me out a ton. All right. If you guys aren't subscribed, please consider subscribing. Like I said, it helps me out a, but a bunch and it just makes me feel good when you guys subscribe. You know, it makes me want to keep pushing out content. It makes me want to keep recording videos. I record not just for the views, but I record mainly because I enjoy recording. I enjoy making the videos. I enjoy sitting down, recording, talking commenting doing the whole thing and editing and uploading it's just very fulfilling for me and i just really really enjoy it so if you guys want to um join me as i continue to make content and if you guys want to keep watching these videos go right ahead i'm not going to stop you um yeah um i'm liking subnautica right now it's a very fun game it's a lot of fun actually and um i don't see myself stopping anytime soon um so uh yeah you guys like the video don't forget to leave a like on the video and, intake recommended. and comment um and i'll see you guys in the next video bye